Hello everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic, Knights of the Fallen Empire, Episode 8. Last time we managed to get this ship, the Gravestone, in the air, when we were being attacked by a bunch of Zakul Knights and Droids. And now, let's find out what happens next. How about that? My gravestone can move! So it is yours now. Okay, this is my ship. Your gravestone. Do not lay claim to the belongings of others. Right. And let me guess who you think this ship belongs to. Incoming! Dropping out of hyperspace! It's... it's a lot! Oh dear. The Eternal Fleet. They aren't firing. Probably because they're going to try and scoop us up. Ugly ship. What are you waiting for? Take it. Okay, now they're firing. HK, see about that hyperdrive. Lana, work the shields. And we need a gunner. I'll take care of it. Okay, Koth, it's your ship now. It's been destroyed, you know. It's just, I don't need it. Like it's not like it's gonna survive. I highly doubt it's survive. Well, I might do. I don't know. I guess we'll see. HK, you got your own job. Go away. Go and do your own job. Oh, fine. Wait, they boarded my ship. Damn it. Sorry, cough ship. Sorry, sorry. Right, HK, go, go away and do your own thing. I can survive. I can survive. You know, this is coffee. It's gonna be pretty easy to kill anyone, to be honest, in this game right now, because that's how easy Bioware have made it. But fine, open the door and let's go. I said let's go! There we go. Although actually... Nah, I'll be alright. I was a bit concerned because I was losing a bit more damage. But I think I'll be alright as long as I heal myself up after every battle. Righto, let's do this! Omni cannons up. There's a capital ship near the center. I see it. Good. Now hit it. Oh, I've got the feeling this is going to be amazing. Please be amazing. That's my ship. Well done, ship. Well done. Target down. It's Wait, yours again. Five targets. Ten. I can't keep up. It's mine again. It's real. Wow. We could take the whole fleet. Statement. The hyperdrive now meets minimum functionality requirements. Why didn't you say so? All right, let's get out of here. Bye bye. More than two dozen ships lost in a single shot. So that's the gravestone. It's as powerful as they say. Everything stands at risk. So cool, the throne, my vision for the galaxy. All because we let the Outlander slip away. I'm not blaming you. I didn't think you were. Father held us all back. You, more than any. Such raw power, and yet you're still spreading your wings, finding your limits. Nice to be appreciated for a change. So, what now? Now, I act. Uh-oh. What are you gonna do about it? I wonder where we are. No, no, no! What's it's happened? You, it's your ship again. The hyperdrive worked. One time. Omni cannons fried too. What a mess. We're safely away from the fleet, if nothing else. 
should be able to make it to asylum, but let's not hold our breath. Asylum? Who's being committed? Not that kind of asylum. <laughs> asylum is a skyport. A safe haven from Arkin's patrols. Was she really necessary? She helped us raise the gravestone. She fought at our side. She also hunted me like an animal for years. She was Arkin's loyal knight. I thought I was in service to Zakul. You had abandoned your responsibilities. Uh... Let's get along. It sounds like you're both on the same side now. Whatever history you have, it's best to let it go. You don't know what she's capable of. You weren't there. Do they know what you're capable of, Vortana? If anybody needs me, I'll be somewhere. Nice place, isn't it? Somewhere. You could have at least consulted with me first. Yes, I wonder how that might have gone. It's like we had time. Absolutely! I'd be glad to fix the gravestone by myself. Thank you! Uh, who am I going to check in with? Well, Koff is a bit more angrier than Lana, so I should probably go check in with him. Fine. Ooh, gather tools to repair the ship. Ah, is this sort of like... Oh, I'm sorry you're in a bit of a heat right now. But... Look what I got! I got some tools to repair the ship with! Uh, where can I find the tools? I can find the tools up here! Alright! Uh, there's one tool. I assume there's going to be another tool around here somewhere. There's got to be. Oh, actually no, it's saying there's tools all over the place. Oh, fine. Best go look! Yay! Don't you just love spam mail? Joy! Love it so much! I remember the days when there was barely any spam mail for Knights of the Fallen Empire, uh, not, not Fall Empire for Star Wars The Old Republic. Literally, it's only really come into effect more in recent months. Literally about a year... Okay. There's some wing moors on the ship. Okay, that's that's fine. Um, yeah, it's only recently come into effect in the current few months, really. It didn't really happen during launch. Surprisingly, but hey, I need one more tool. Where are they? Um, gotta be another tool around here somewhere. Oh, I'll find one. Aha! Here's another tool. Thank you very much. And I would take the experience. Okay, I've got to repair the damaged door first, which is. I don't know. Where is it? Oh, it's upstairs as well. Alrighty! Uh, damaged door, damaged door, damaged door would be this one. And I would take my credits and my experience, thank you very much. I'm so close to level 65. Seriously, wait. Oh, you've, oh, you've given me my stuff. Alright, is there anything behind the door? I don't know. Um, I don't know, let's find out. I assume there's a reason why we fixed this door. Ooh, maybe now I can get my ship. Maybe my ship, I'll find my ship and it'll come through here. That's what I'm kind of assuming will happen now. You know, I will find my ship and everyone will be safe. Everyone. Because I'm kind of worried that when I let Vet attack the uh, the fleet and when I uh, went full speed into the fleet and destroyed a bunch of ships, I'm kind of worried I might have um, did a bit of damage to my ship and the people on it, you know? Why can't there be a maintenance manual? Hey, can you get the power? Right over there. Thanks. Wouldn't want to electrocute myself on top of everything else. She's really something, this ship. But no one's been taking care of her. You've grown attached rather quickly. No offense, but it's the gravestone that will save the galaxy from Arkin. Not you, not me, definitely not Senya. What did Senya do to earn this grudge? She was ruthless. After we deserted, she hunted us for months. Everyone on my crew bled more than once on account of her. I put all my trust in Lana and she goes to Senya for help. She does not know what she's getting us into. Senya acts according to... I don't know what. Her own narrow concept of justice, maybe. Even if her objectives align with yours, it doesn't mean she'll do what you need to get done. Believe me, just don't forget who dropped everything to storm the spire and help Lana pull you out of Carbonite. Alright? 
I'd be a frozen carcass if you hadn't. I have a good feeling, you know. We'll get Arkin. I should get back to it. Need to be sure the gravestone can get us all the way to Asylum. Hey, I know Lana doesn't seem to be in the talking mood, but maybe check in on her. I wonder if it mattered who you went to first. I highly doubt it does. I mean, this is one of those reasons. This is one of those moments where it probably doesn't. But hey, there's no bonus. Oh, yeah, there's a thought. I wonder what the bonus mission would have been if I'd gone to Lana first, or would it? Or would there not have been? And it would have just been like, well, you would have done the bonus mission anyway. You could have done the bonus mission anyway with Koth. I don't know. We'll find out one day. Hey, Lana, how you doing? Angry, I see. Your display of power, it concerns me. Deeply. I hope you've considered that its use must come at a cost, a very personal cost. I wasn't about to let you die. No life is worth risking total corruption. Valkorin may prove to be of some use, but he's no less dangerous than when he was alive. That's why we need all the help we can get, and Senya will be a great help. I hope you can see that. You could have let me know we had backup on the way. I wanted you to encounter her without my guidance, to see if you saw her as I did. We met shortly after I arrived in Wild Space. Senya was hunting Koth. I was hoping to learn your fate. We exchanged what information we could. This was all before I really knew Koth, of course. Years ago. Those two will have to get past their differences. It won't be easy. I should continue my meditation. And you should get to know Senya. I'm not sure if you'll hit it off exactly, but I think you'll find her intriguing. How intriguing? I don't know. Well, I mean... I mean... Jaser has found a new love. So... Maybe I should do the same. You know? Maybe, maybe I could find love in Senya. Maybe? Yeah. Doubt it. Jaysa, I will wait for you! I wonder what she'll say when we're reunited. She'll be like, oh, I'm with someone else now, but... Oh. Query, has the meatbag bickering finally exhausted itself? Were you eavesdropping? Correction, I was monitoring activity in order to ensure everyone's safety, Master. Correction! Report, I have taken the liberty of checking in on your band of refugees. Assessment, they have quickly taken to their new lodging arrangements. I have warned them not to stray from their chosen location. Analysis. There are many sealed passageways, and I am unable to detect what may be on the other side. Worth looking into at some point. Revelation. I discovered an especially strange area. Unlike anywhere else on the gravestone, I had attempted to ascertain if any of its contents could be weaponized, but the new meat bag interrupted. Query. Any orders, Master? Um, lend Koth a hand. See if there's anything you can do to help Koth with his repairs. Sarcasm. Excitement. I can't wait to spend more time with him. Oh, you're hilarious, HK. Uh, investigate the Dark Sanctuary, which is... Oh, you're really taking me in a circle, aren't you? Damn. Right, I wonder if Senya knows anything about this place on the gravestone. Maybe she can give you some more insight. Can only hope. Senya, Senya, where are you, Senya? Better not be something bad. Or, I should say, better not be something good. <laughs> I know. I couldn't help but take this place in either. Reminds me of a song I wrote. I'd like to hear that. Just a few bars? Without accompaniment? I'm not that brave. You seem nothing at all like the person I met in the swamp. Being a knight means everything. But I don't let it define me. When it's time to go to work, I'm who I need to be. The rest of the time, I'm just myself. You don't strike me as all that different. It's true. I live by a code. But I don't follow it to the letter. I've heard your code. Victory from passion. It's a powerful notion. Very much like how Arkin operates. I know why I oppose him. 
What's your reason? Years after the death of our immortal Emperor, most are still so afflicted with remorse that they don't see what's happening. Arkin has become oppressive and cruel. He'll crush anyone who doesn't share his plan for the galaxy. So that's me. What about you? Uh... I want revenge, really. Arkin took five years of my life. Turned everything inside out. He has to pay. I know what that's like. Not exactly, but I see where you're coming from. You're not what I expected. Not sure if that's good or bad yet. But I do know I'll have an easier time with you than Koth. I hope you'll try to get along. The more we work together, the better off we'll be. Just because he betrayed our enemy doesn't change the fact that he was a traitor. You need to be cautious. But technically you're a traitor too, right? Just saying. Valkorian lives. He is not himself. Nor has he taken a new body. Basila? Not Basila. It um, is difficult Satil. to see. Satil. And yet it is unmistakable. His presence in the Force has always been deceptive. Like on the Yavin moon. Yes. And many times before and since. Even when my life depended on it, I did not see him properly until it was too late. Mars definitely dead then. Okay, fine. <laughs> I was hoping he, he might secretly be alive, but no, he's definitely dead because he's a force apparition now. Joy. Oh, I wonder what this is. What this environment is supposed to be about. I guess there's only one way to find out. And it tells you to press space bar. Chapter 6, Asylum. Approaching Asylum. Told you we'd make it. We haven't docked yet. I should probably figure out how to land this thing. Uh... There's no way we're keeping the gravestone low profile. If Arkin has agents here... Asylum might be the only place in wild space free of his control. That shadow port isn't on any chart. It's a haven for refugees fleeing Arkin's forces. We'll be among friends. But isn't there a possible chance somebody might have mentioned it to Arkin? Possibly? Just saying. Mostly. Tell your associates we've arrived. They knew that days ago. You want to explain how? Figures. Tell us who your people are and how they know so much. I think you'd rather hear that from them. Command. Are we there yet? <laughs> you had to be that person, didn't you, HK? Get the feeling this is going to be bumpy. Hi, people. Might just be able to scrape in. Oh, 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 come on, stop the ship. And we're good. Oh, a bit bumpy, like I said.
Oh. Move it, Gawkers. Let it through. Uh, trouble? Mighty fine ship you got there. We'll be coming aboard. Uh, doubt it. In how many pieces? Ha! Captain! Oh. Who? Outlander, my crew. The best engine burners in wild space. You let them pick a fight. You could have introduced them sooner. This was more fun. Get up here, you mangy woolocks. You recognize me. You know who I am, don't you? Name's Rollo. I served aboard Darth Mars destroyer. We thought you died with him. They haven't invented the thing that can kill me. Some of us aren't so lucky. A lot of good people died that day. You didn't give us enough time to make the escape pods. I didn't have many options. It was a hard decision, but the right one. We'll never know, will we? Raylo! Get in here! On my way! Oh, that's just one thing of what I'm my actions have done. Hiding things. We share on a need-to-know basis. Koth's crew didn't need knowing. They seem... nice? Not how I'd describe them, but they get the job done. I need to make contact with my network, alone. Try to stay out of trouble. Please tell me you found my crew. You better bring me that news soon. Where's Lana? Excellent question. My best engineer hasn't come back from a supply run to the free zone. It's a dodgy neighborhood if you catch my drift. A black market. Rival syndicates disagree over who controls it. They argue with blasters. I think she's in trouble, but we've got our hands full keeping the Gravestone's reactor stable. Uh, Give me a hollow of your crewmate and point me to this free zone. I'll handle the rest. Addendum. I will join you, master. My engineer's name is Tora. HK has her image in its databanks. She won't be hard to find. Tora has a big personality. She's surlier than a hungry rancor, but she's the best engineer you'll ever meet. Thanks for the help. And when you're done, find me these coordinates. I'll introduce you to my people. Make sure there's food. I haven't eaten in five years. Ha ha. But don't eat the roast Gorak. Har har har. Am I going to be reaching level 65 now? I am indeed. And there we go. And there's no achievement for it. What? No achievement to reach level 65? How dare you? How dare you? Unless there secretly was that I just didn't know about. Um, no. Don't need to go there. Um, where would I go for that achievement? I assume it would be in general, wouldn't it? For planets. Uh, no. Level. There we go. Uh, Sith Warrior. No. They haven't added an achievement for level 65. Damn it, Bioware. Why? I look forward to those achievements. It gives me an incentive to level up to get those achievements. Oh, well. So, anyway, that was episode 8. We're now at the Asylum. Or just Asylum. And we need to go to the Free Zone next time. So, anyway, thank you very much for watching. Ladies and gentlemen, and I will see you next time, and a farewell to you.